So what I really liked in school was uh, physics and math. And so from there, it seemed pretty natural to study engineering, which is applying physics and math in the real world. And actually then, after my undergrad in electrical engineering, I actually wasn't so sure what to do, because literally anything engineering seemed interesting to me. Like understanding how anything works seems interesting. Trying to build anything is interesting. And in, in some sense, artificial intelligence won out because it seemed like it could um, somehow help all disciplines in some way. And also it seemed somehow a little more at the core of everything. Like if you think about how a machine can think, then maybe that's more the core of everything else than picking any specific discipline. I was very interested in um, artificial intelligence, and so I took classes in artificial intelligence. But a lot of what I was seeing there was just very not satisfying. Like it was a lot of kind of, uh, you know, depth first search, breath first search, uh, alpha beta pruning and all these things. And I was like not understanding how, like I was not satisfied. And so when I was seeing neural networks for the first time, like and in machine learning, which is kind of this term that I think is more technical and not as well known in kind of, uh, you know, most people talk about artificial intelligence. Machine learning was more kind of a technical term, I would almost say. And so I was dissatisfied with artificial intelligence. And when I saw machine learning, I was like, this is the AI that I want to kind of spend time on.